Hey guys, it's Tash, and I'm filming this first thing in the morning, so it's kind of weird because, I mean, this is like the first time I've spoke, kind of, ish. I sound a bit funny. Hello. Been to Primark again, so we've got another Primark haul. It's not a massive one because, like I said in my previous one, I don't normally spend a lot of money in there. I'm gonna just start off with something that I bought on eBay. Um, if anyone knows Cutie Pie Marcia, Cutie Pie's girlfriend, she was wearing this in one of her videos and also in one piece because they obviously filmed it at the same time. And I just loved it because I, it was my fav one of my favourite films, my second favourite film to be exact. And the t shirt was just amazing. This one. Now what I really loved about it is that it's oversized and I love the colour of it and the fact that it's tie-dye and just Jurassic Park, like I love Jurassic Park, okay. And I haven't got a Jurassic Park t-shirt, I like having t-shirts of things I like and so I was like this is perfect, like it's a lot better than any like official Jurassic Park t-shirt would be and I like how it's got like the palm trees in the background. Right, I'm going to start off with just like accessories and stuff because I don't really get to the end but I thought you know I'll leave the like, best till last. Um, I got some sheer tights. If you've seen my Mathlan haul, I bought some like kind of skin colour tights but you know they were kind of really weird and I went for a stick here because I thought you know they keep you warmer and I kind of regret it. I didn't really know what I was buying because I was online and I didn't really care the most because I had £10 off and tights were technically free. So, um, I don't really care. So, I just bought these for £2 and it's a pack of five. And um, I watched a YouTuber, Becky Crawl, and she actually had a tip of you can, also you can wear these with like skirts and shorts and dresses and stuff in the winter, unless you want to like be warmer. You could wear two pairs maybe. And she said that you could also wear knee high socks over it because, of course, it keeps them up. And then it's a way of wearing knee high socks without getting your thighs cold. Because I don't really like wearing the, my knee high socks in the summer. And then I won't wear them in the winter because, of course, I don't want my thighs to get old. I will wear them if I'm at home all day. But I thought that's actually a really good tip because there's also, you can get those tights that have the over the knee sock look. And I have some like it, like with Jaguars and ones with hearts. But I have a lot of different types of knee high socks and I never tend to wear them, so I probably will with these. Um, I saw these socks and I thought these were super cute. Just to kind of like wine red colour with little sequins on. Now I don't really know how I'd wear them. I might probably probably wear them like over tights um, with some boots or something just put them on show rather than wearing them underneath jeans. I have more cute socks however the thing is with these two pairs is that I wouldn't know how to wear them. Um, I wouldn't want to wear them like out to work with um, my work shoes because my work shoes tend to put holes in my socks and I don't want to ruin these. And then also they're not really ones that I'd probably wear with tights. So I probably would just wear them kind of at home. But they are just adorable. Like here's the first pair. These are really weird material as well. As the first pair, like how adorable is that? It's they match my top that I had in the other haul. But they are cute. And then these ones, I'm sure um, Marcy I would love these. Little pug with a Santa hat on. How cute is that? I bought another pair of these tights. I don't know if I showed these in a haul. Um, I think I might have bought these the time I didn't do a haul video, which is actually the same time I bought these um, pajama leggings, I guess you'd say, because they are leggings. And yeah, I wore these yesterday when I went shopping, but um, where I'd been like, you know, kind of adjusting them, I must mind, I have a long thumbnail, and I must have um, like kind of ripped them a bit because they've laddered, and I made, I've only worn them like twice, and they made me realize like, because obviously Primark are cheap, but it's not so great when it comes to tights, but them being cheap. Now, um, if it was just the hole, it could have been sewn up, but ladder is not so great. I'm going to do the whole nail varnish thing where I like, put nail varnish on it and it won't make it ladder anymore. But I bought these for spares because I really realised that they're, I want to wear these ones a lot because I love these ones. 
and I know they're not going to last. They're bound to just completely get wrecked to a point where I can't like save them. So I bought some spare ones because I know that I will be wearing them in ye many years to come. So I bought there. I think this is my last accessory thing. Um, I wanted to get, you know, like you can get the cat ear headbands. They had one of them, but those loads of pearls missing, and I wanted that one. But this is another one that I wanted to get, and luckily it was, it, it was alright. It was the last one as well. Devil ears. And I was just like, they're so cute. Like, I would just wear these wherever, and I thought they were perfect for me because I'm a bit of a bitch. Of course, can't really have a good look at with that one. But I was like, yeah, they're cute. And they're like, kind of, you can kind of not really see them that well. So they're not like weird. It's not like if you actually went out with proper, like, devil horn headband on, like you wear at Halloween on the second floor. And it's really cute. Like, as the woman who served me said, it's kind of got an oriental print on it. And it's like, this little kind of kimono type little jacket. Thing is, it's short sleeves, so I don't know if I would really wear it in the winter because I don't really like wearing short sleeve things with the long sleeve top underneath. But I might wear it like just at home, and I'll probably wear it more in the summer. However, it is cute and would look nice with a plain top and maybe just some nice um simple jeans or um, shorts and tights. It's really cute. And there's the pattern on it. Now these last few items are the best things ever. Um, when I walked into Primark, my Primark, when you walk in the doors, there's a bit like just ahead of the entrance and it's this section where they put, like because obviously they normally put things together, like they'll put coats together, leggings together, jeans together, tops together best together, everything will be in its own kind of section. Whereas this section is like constantly changing and it's like a trend at the time. It was filled with Christmas clothes. Now of course you can get your Christmas jumpers and everything, but this was like seriously just filled with Christmas. And there was also more Christmas stuff to the right. Didn't get anything from that there. But the front bit, oh my god, I was freaking out because we planned to go downstairs to men's first because we were going to look at home look at Christmas stuff and then have a look at men and then we were going to go up and oh my god like I freaked out I went over and I was picking up all this stuff I picked up like three Christmas jumpers I only got one the two I didn't get are on my Instagram so if you want to check them out just check out my Instagram it's just Tash Rainbow but I got this one because I was like this is my favourite definitely I got a size 14 so it would be bigger and I just love the um, print on it like it's so Christmassy, like Santa up on his sleigh and all the snow everywhere and the glitter and it's just so pretty and Christmassy and I love it and I'm gonna like, I'm gonna wear it on like Christmas Day or Christmas Eve, I don't know because there's another thing I got which I'm, I, so out of the two of them, it'll be one of, I'll be wearing one on each day, I know that, it just depends, I guess. I really, really love this. And while it's Christmassy, it's not so Christmassy that I couldn't wear it any other time. Of course, I can't wear it in the summer, but it, I could wear it in the winter because it's one of those wintry prints. And it's this one. It's a nice t shirt. I really like shirts like this, like with the folded arms. And it's kind of oversized and perfect to tuck into things and I just love patterns like this I would kind of describe it as kind of being like an Aztec print where it has the lines of different things and it's just so cute the little like pixelated stuff on it like the hearts and even though it's reindeer and people might class that as being Christmas I think that reindeers can get away with being winter just winter and um it's just cute you know and look at the little heart and everything, it's adorable and I love the colours, the colours are very Christmassy. Oh and there's little Christmas trees actually, I never noticed that. There's little Christmas trees in it. Oh well. And now the last thing, which I'm hoping my camera doesn't die, um, is the other really Christmassy thing. And it's the same as the last item, it is a big nice oversized top. And it's this one. And it's so cute because 
of the pattern. Like my favourite bit of it is the penguins because the penguins are adorable. But I just love all the Christmassy stuff like those the Christmas trees and the snowmen and the holly. And I'm guessing this is some kind of like Christmas decoration, like lights or something, and snowflakes. And yeah, this is the other thing which I'm gonna wear one on Christmas Eve and one on Christmas Day. And they're just so adorable. Like I've never really seen like so many Christmas um, items like clothing because. Of course, I work in Matalan, they don't have all that stuff. But there's a few like Christmassy jumpers, and that's literally it. And that's only over in the men's section. And while I don't like these, like, kind of, you know, typical Christmas jumpers, because I think I don't want to spend money on something like that when it doesn't even look fashionable. No offense to anyone that has one. Yeah, I would like to have one because it's nice because it's a Christmassy thing. But I like to have one that just looks more kind of in fashion, if you know what I mean. So, yeah. And um, it wasn't a big haul, like I only spent like 40 quid I think, yeah, and um, of course I started, it was one of those days where I start off with only a few, few things, like I took like nine things in the change room, came out with three, and I was like oh my god I've really got three things, and then I ended up getting a lot more on the other floors, didn't even get any jewellery, only the headband, I can't believe that, but um, yeah, like it ended up adding up with all the socks and everything, but you know, it was... It was a good day, I'm, I'm pleased with myself, even though it was actually I was meant to go Christmas shopping and didn't get any Christmas presents. But I bought two things on eBay last night, so I'm happy with myself. So yeah. But um, so let me know, have you started your Christmas shopping, even though this is all my stuff? Um, but yeah, let me know if you've started your Christmas shopping. And let me know if you have any Christmassy clothes, because Christmassy clothes are great. And do love Christmas, you've got to love Christmas. I'm like, oh my god, I'm so ready for Christmas. I just want decorations up now. Why can't we have decorations up for two months? Like, I, I, I just love them, okay? I can't wait till my shop plays Christmas music. Oh my god, I'm so ready. Oh my god, that was so wrong, I didn't check that, I believe. Anyway, I will like see you around in my next video, so... Bye!